Okay, let's continue on with our lesson. Sharing my screen. This one says, solve using a model or equation, show your work, and write your answer as a statement. The movie theater has two rooms. Room A has seven rows of seats with 14 seats in each row. Room B has three times as many seats as room A. How many seats are there in both rooms? So I know it has two rooms. A has seven rows of seats with 14 seats in each row. B has three times as many seats as the first room. So then the question is how many seats are there in both rooms? So I'm gonna start with A and I know A has seven rows with 14 seats in each row, right? Room A, okay, and then B, whatever this is, it has three times as many as A. So what, whenever we figure out A, we know B has three times as many as A. Okay, so let's start by figuring out A. Let's use our partial products. So if I was gonna do that, I could do seven ones times four ones, 28. And then I can do 110, times seven, 70, add those two together. Get 98 and remember that, so that's A's. And remember room B has three times as many seats as room A. So that's three times the 98 that we just figured out for A. You could add all those, but let's just use a standard algorithm and say 98 times three. So we have 24 and then nine times three is 27 plus two more, 29. Okay, so we know that is B. So then it says, how many seats are there in both rooms? So what am I gonna do to figure that out? I'm gonna add. So I'm gonna add how many were in B to how many were in A. So 12, nine and nine, 18 plus one more, 19. So I get 392, I need to write it as a statement. So I'm just gonna use my question, how many seats are there in both rooms? Room A and B have a total of 392. Okay, let's look at the next one. Okay, this one says the high school art teacher has six cases. So we have a high school art teacher has six cases of crayons with 61 boxes in each case. Then we have another teacher, elementary school teacher has nine cases of crayons with 112 boxes in each case. The question says, how many total boxes of crayons do both teachers have? And then they ask, is your answer reasonable? And you have to explain it. So let's start with the high school art teacher. Well, we know the high school art teacher has six cases with 61 boxes in each case. Okay. And what do we know about the elementary school teacher? We know the elementary school teacher has nine cases with 112 boxes. Okay, and then the question is, how many total boxes of crayons do both teachers have? Well, first I have to figure out how much each teacher has. So let's start with the first one. Let's use standard algorithm 61 times six. Six times one is six, and six times six is 36. So that's how much the 
high school art teacher has. Now let's check elementary school. I have 112 times nine. Nine times two, 18. Nine times one is nine. Plus one more makes 10. Nine times one is nine again, plus one more, 10. Okay, so then it says, how many total crowns do both teachers have? Well, in order to figure that out, I have to add those two numbers together. Eight plus six is 14. Six plus one is seven. Three, that's supposed to be a three. And then I have a one. So I have 1,374, but before I can answer the question, it says, is your answer reasonable? Reasonable just means that they want you to estimate and check your answer. So if I was gonna estimate before I solve, so I'd say six times, let's say 60, that's pretty close to 61. Six times six is 36, add a zero, that's 360. And then I'll say nine times, 110 is pretty close to 112. We're just making an estimate. So nine times 11 is 99. I'm adding a zero and I could add those up. Nine, five. Okay, so then is it reasonable? Yeah, it's pretty close to this one. So now I'm just gonna answer all of the question that they're asking here. So let's answer the first part says, how many total boxes of crayons do both teachers have? I'm gonna use what they said and give it back to them. Um, I'm gonna say the high school teacher and elementary teacher have a total of 1,374 boxes of crayons together. And then when it says, is your answer reasonable? I can say my answer is reasonable because it is close to my estimate of 1,350.